Welcome to the official Windows 8 channel and today we're going to talk about a little subject that's been going around the web. I've actually been a victim of that also. Um, IE 11, Internet Explorer 11 freezes when you're on YouTube and it's interesting because it's the only website where it freezes. I've used Internet Explorer 11 quite extensively and finally the only fix that works for me and that I found also that seems to work for a lot of people if you go on YouTube with IE 11 and you find yourself that YouTube freezes all the time because that's what happened to me you can watch two or three different videos and it freezes up there's a fix that you can apply that seems to work and um, I would like a lot of feedback about it if people uh, if you are victim of that problem of IE 11 freezing on YouTube, try it out and let me know if it works for you. And if it does, that's cool. If it doesn't, we'll try to find other types of fixes that we can apply. The um, fix that I have and that works really well, and my IE 11 has not frozen at all on YouTube since I did that, just go into your desktop version of IE11. So go on your desktop uh, first of all and once you're on your desktop then go and click the Internet Explorer browser. You can click if you have it the menu bar uh, the tools option you'll see ActiveX filtering if you don't see it there go into your little pinwheel on the upper right side of your screen go into safety what you want to have is a check mark in front of ActiveX filtering. This is what is um, this is what's going to unfreeze basically your uh, YouTube experience. Uh, ActiveX filtering means that um, some of the websites won't have their ActiveX components um, working necessarily. And the problem with this fix is that some websites might might actually not work well after you apply it but at least you can temporarily have a fix with that when you go on YouTube just turn it on and if you wanna uh, go to other websites you can actually just go back and turn it off so uh, just click ActiveX filtering to make sure you have that check mark when you do that you will have messages on YouTube that you don't have flash player you need to click and download and install the latest version it doesn't matter it does not prevent you from watching YouTube actually so if you click videos on YouTube uh, like this one for example uh, it's gonna tell you okay there's a possibility of uh, not having a flash player that's maybe gonna pop up for a few seconds on top but it actually doesn't prevent at all the YouTube experience from working so it doesn't really matter whatever you click even if it says it doesn't have flash player it's still gonna work and so basically if you uh, do this little fix your experience should be okay interestingly I haven't found any websites yet that even if I keep the ActiveX filtering check mark there on uh, the safety uh, side of Internet Explorer. Um, I haven't found any websites that didn't seem to want to work because I had that check mark right here. But if you experience some weird browsing experience, then uh, maybe you want to try ActiveX filtering for uh, the fixing of Internet Explorer on YouTube. So, uh, hope it works for you and the fix is great. So, remember, you're going to, uh, if you have the menu bar, you need to be in the uh, desktop version of IE 11. Just click Tools at the top. If you don't have that menu bar, you can go on the right side. You have the little pinwheel just below the red X to close the window. And go into Safety and uh, just click ActiveX Filtering. What you want to have is the check mark. So, if it's not there, you want to have the check mark there and uh, on my side uh, basically there's no more freezes in IE 11 since I uh, put that check mark so uh, hopefully it's gonna work for you also if you have any comments or questions on what you've seen let us know uh, give me your feedback did that fix help you solve if it did not then we'll try to find 
some other permanent fix um, to make IE11 uh, work better and stop freezing on YouTube. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe to our channel. You'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions on what you've seen, maybe you have a feature or a problem in Windows 8 that you want us to make a video about, uh, please let us know. We'll try to make videos. And uh, hopefully you enjoy our channel and we'll uh, be coming back to the official Windows 8 channel. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.